What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. And I am, y'all heard that echo? To another video. Hold on, wait. To another video. <laughs> you boy got tone and range and um, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Welcome back to another video, you guys. It's your first time here. Make sure you thumbs up my video, click like, click subscribe, all of the above. Um, so today I decided to do the Starbucks. Um, I'm right outside Starbucks because of, um, I'm gonna hold this camera. Oh, this is a better angle. I'm outside of Starbucks um, because of course, um, due to regulations with you know everything that's going on right now, um, it's just safer that way. Um, and I chose to do the Starbucks. So this is what we're doing today. Just looking for somewhere I can sit my things down here and try some of these coffees. Just give me a little, oh, excuse me. What is that? Mm, this is kind of spooky. Eh? Anyway, mm, can't sit it there. I'm trying to find somewhere to sit it. Let me get y'all a <coughs> So, of course it wants to, um, I don't even care. <laughs> so the first car, well, let me say this. I was, all oh, this traffic, Jesus Christ. All right, so we're gonna have to work with what we got. So anyway, I've heard so much about the um, people trying the uh, Starbucks coffees, um, holiday coffee, so I grabbed myself one. And yeah, so we're right outside Starbucks due to um, safety reasons which you know everybody understands. So the first one that I have is going to be the Caramel Brulee is what it's called. And I have the list on a camera, I mean on my phone, I took a picture of all the, so I can remember every time I get one, which one it is. Um, don't claim to be the best fan of coffee. Don't claim to not be a fan of coffee. I used to work at a coffee shop. I actually was a barista for a very long time. So anyway, without further ado, I'm gonna try to find us somewhere qu more quiet so that we can do this. So this traffic ain't gonna kid, all right? Um, so we're gonna try the caramel brulee first. I'm gonna be shit, shit, shit. Um, it's, um, it's very coffee-y. Definitely not all that sweet. Um, it's not as sweet as I thought it was gonna be because they put like these little sugar chips on top of it. And I was like, oh man, that looks good. I think that was supposed to be like the um, brulee of it or whatnot. Um, and I don't claim to, let me get under here. I don't claim to go to Starbucks every single day. So I'm not like an aficionado um, of their products or whatever. Um, but it's not bad very warm and y'all do apologize for the traffic in the background um, this is just I mean I have to be outside so I'm sure y'all understand so not a big deal uh, <laughs> yeah I'm sure it's not a big deal but this is the caramel brulee so what do you guys get when y'all go to Starbucks like what is you what are some of your favorite um because you know one thing i've just never really been a fan of um i'd love to give you guys this background scenery of um where i am because i mean i don't live in the area so it's not really a big deal this camera's kind of heavy either way <laughs> we're gonna be drinking so much coffee today i'm gonna be bouncing off the walls um i do have some cooking to do but it's not really um, something that I just need high energy for, so not really concerned. I really want to find us somewhere. So, what's some of y'all? I'm just gonna walk. What's some of y'all's favorite um, coffee drinks or favorite things to get while at Starbucks? Um, I saw they had uh, many different types of coffee, but they also had desserts. Also, do y'all get desserts when you go there? Because I've seen the desserts at Starbucks before. And um, they kind of like those, um, you know, pastries that, you know, just are kind of there all the time. Um, I'm going to go under here. It seems like the best thing to do. Hold on. You guys. 
this, this is, okay, this is better. Whew. All right, so hopefully there's no echo, y'all can see me, yeah. So this is the caramel brulee. I should have got a smaller one, I should have got the smallest one, but I thought that this would be the one that I like the most, so I'd get a bigger one. I don't know how much, I didn't really think about it. And my arm hurts. Oh, I don't even have their product in the camera. Um, I didn't really think about it when I was thinking about, you know, do they do they just sip the coffee? I'm sorry, y'all, so close. Do they just sip the coffee? Do they drink all of the coffee? I didn't watch the video because I wanted mine to be personable. <laughs> oh, well. All right, y'all, so I found somewhere um, to sit. So the next one that I'm going to be trying is toasted white chocolate mocha. I can believe people drink. I can say that. They're good. Mm. Okay, let me show up my phone on my wife because Nika's is watching and I hate to have to beat up his ass. <laughs> anyway, toasted white chocolate mocha. Tastes toasty. Mmm. Tastes mocha y. My stomach's gonna be hanging out my goddamn boot hole. <laughs> There's no other way to describe it. There's literally no other way to describe what's been happening after I sit up and drink all the goddamn coffee. I mean, I did not think this all the way through. Like when I tell you, I didn't think it all the way through. I didn't think it all the way through. Um, or maybe I should just watch the video first because maybe they are not um, drinking all of the coffee. Um, maybe it's a lot going on. Maybe they ain't drinking all the coffee. Maybe they just sipping and just seeing like what it tastes like or whatever. And my crazy self over here like if I'm sitting up here spending all this money on uh, coffee because this is like five dollars a cup. You know what I'm saying? So you spend all this money on coffee, then of course you just gonna wanna. I hope y'all can hear me. There's a lot going on up in here. Um, but yeah, if you're spending all this money on coffee, then you gonna drink it, right? All right. I'm definitely gonna drink it. It's gonna take a little sec. And I mean, I drink it all. I mean, just yeah. Look, I'm rubbing my stomach already. <laughs> I'm already rubbing my damn stomach. This shit got my stomach hurt. Why do coffee make your motherfucking stomach hurt like that? I'm too far away from home. It's raining. I'm walking. Oh my god. 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 I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish this video. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh no, y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish this video. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna take another sip. I'm drinking. I'm drinking. I'm drinking. God. It's, um, this definitely has a very strong coffee um, taste. What is coffee for again? Is it for energy? I think these days it's kind of become like a um, um, trendy thing to do is what I'm thinking um, these days. I don't, I don't know if y'all see me. I don't know. I, mean, you know. I just feel like I never look in the camera. So this guy's like right next to me just keeps going up in his bag, but he don't know I'm a motherfucking thug and I'm a motherfucking G. I'm a motherfucking G up in my, by my shit, you know what I'm saying? So I don't want it to be no misunderstanding. Like Whooping at it! <laughs> no, I'm just playing, y'all. Um, my stomach hurt. So this was the white chocolate mocha. So we're gonna go get the next one. All right, so we got the next one. <laughs> So this one is peppermint mocha. Now I know for a fact, I'm just, I ain't the biggest fan of um, peppermint. So I may not like this one as much as the other ones. And then of course, when I'm drinking coffee, I like for my coffee to be sweeter. Um, Y'all don't be in the comments about me, about the mask, ain't nobody around me. I'm outside in a public open space. Um, it may not look like it, but it is. 
So either way, <clears throat> um, ooh, what's going on here? Um, ooh, they can have a rake. Ooh, they can have a rake. Y'all wanna see, I ain't gonna let y'all see it, it's embarrassing. Then they really gonna rake. Um, so this one is peppermint. And y'all comment below, because I'm pretty sure y'all have seen people do the, and I, this is my first year doing Vlogmas, this is my first year doing um, Starbucks coffee, so please, uh, bear with the kid, please. Who in a right mind? You know, you know, this reminds me of uh, those Andes which I kind of like the Andes, but it really reminds me of uh, like those Girl Scout Thin Mints. Have y'all ever had, you know, people actually sit there and eat those, like the Girl Scout Thin Mints, and it's just like all mint. Like, who wants to sit in? Blah. But, I make your breath smell good. <laughs> if, that, if that's your thing, if that is your thing, um, then you would probably definitely like this one. When I'm drinking coffee, I like for it to be a, you know, more of a sweeter um, taste. And you know, it would have been um, so much nicer. I know you guys, if I'd have been able to film in Starbucks, but everybody understands for the circumstances. I know I've said it like ten times. And if this is your first time here, make sure you thumbs up my video, click like and subscribe below, comment your favorite Starbucks coffee drinks, and yeah, and give me some recommendations because I may not have even ordered it right. You know what I'm saying? Like I may, there may be like a certain way because I don't know, like. I, you know, when I when I told him to make it, I was kind of telling him, you know, you know, this is for my YouTube, da, da 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 da. You know, not to brag or boast or nothing like that, but I'm bragging and boasting. And he put a lid on it. And I was just like, why would you do that? You know, um, but it was too late. So um, at this point, it's in a cup with a lid on. I wanted it to kind of, you know, show the frothy stuff on top with the, you know, sugar pieces and all that. But I guess he wasn't feeling it today. Um, my lucky day that he would, I would get the person, because he looked like he was about to be a good one, but then when I told him what it was for, I think it kind of, um, it kind of uh, gave him a, uh, it made him look nervous about what he had to do, like the task was just too big for him to feel, or something like that, so, um, yeah, that's what you get, maybe I should have just never said nothing, and then just, you know, just kind of let him do his job, you know, just kind of see how it turns out from there because I think I, I think I screwed that one for myself. I really do. But either way, I got it now. <laughs> it was, what's this one? This is like the fifth one. I just feel like I'm about to bounce off the walls. All this um, caffeine and sugar. And like I say, it could have been a little bit more sweeter for my taste because if I'm drinking coffee, I don't want to kill the coffee taste, but I don't want to taste the coffee. I'm difficult, I know. I wasn't expecting any expectations, but yeah. Next is, I know I keep, um, I hope y'all can hear. I'm so sorry about the background noise. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm in a parking garage because the Starbucks is connected to where I'm filming, so. And it's like a little table out here, and they have like little, um, you know, little ornaments out here, or whatever. But either way, I can kind of sit my stuff down. But uh, the next one is chestnut praline. I really think I'm gonna like this one, because I like chestnut and I like praline. So I think I'm gonna like this one. Um, let's see. Yeah, I definitely like that. Definitely like it. I definitely like that. This is good. So the guy with the bag is gone. Um, I don't know. He was looking like he wanted to rob me. <laughs> I hate to stereotype him, but hey, he looked like he wanted to rob me. Uh, but yeah. Starbucks. So this is the next one. This one is chestnut praline. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost sniffing at your nose. <laughs> the old tired cows being sung by a choir. <laughs> I know you guys love me and I love you. <laughs> but um, this is the probably final one. They do have one more 
that I want to try. And there was an eggnog. I know a lot of people ain't the biggest fan of eggnog, but I happen to like eggnog um, in, in, in moderation. In, it was like, oh, baby. The first, this, oh my God. The, uh, the eggnog is worse on me, for me, than the coffee. Um, so definitely like it in moderation, um, small moderation, um, because the first, I mean, I'll drink like, a, I mean, when I say a small, little bitty, small, can y'all see me? When I say a small, little bitty, small cup, I mean a small, little bitty, small cup, like it's a small cup, because that first sip of eggnog for me, uh, excuse me, I wasn't embarrassed. <laughs> that first <laughs> that first sip of eggnog for me, like soon as it drops, soon as one drop hits my stomach, it's over for the kingdom. Um I'm only gonna drink eggnog at home. Just, just let's just say that because I don't like using people's bathrooms in public. TMI, I don't know. Whatever. But that's just what it is, okay? <laughs> so this one was the pray praline, and now that I've given you that explicit description of what eggnog does to me when I drink it, I'm not going to get the eggnog one. So they have a few more and I'll just name them. And of course I'll roll them in the credits in the beginning of the video for those of you that want to go try um, of any of these holiday drinks. This is for Vlogmas. Uh, so I have eggnog latte, peppermint, hot chocolate, pumpkin spice latte, salted caramel, Mocha are all the ones, the other ones that they have. Um, peppermint mocha frappuccino, caramel brulee. So we tried toasted vanilla, chocolate mocha, peppermint mocha, chestnut praline latte, and so wait. So they have a peppermint mocha and they have a peppermint mocha. Frap. I don't think we got the frap. I don't think we got the frap. I think we just got the regular caramel brulee latte. And it might have been a peppermint hot chocolate. It definitely wasn't pumpkin, or it might have been salted caramel mocha. I don't remember. God damn. They ain't nobody here telling them to have all these different types. But I'm so happy I found a Starbucks. Like, it was um, surprisingly hard to do during the. Uh, well, maybe it's because of, you know, everything that's going on. Or maybe this one was just difficult um, because of its location. Maybe I don't know. Like as soon as I walked out the house, it just started raining. It was just like, you know, let this video. Let me tell y'all something. If y'all don't get anything else, I'm look y'all in y'all eyes. I can't look y'all in y'all eyes. <laughs> if y'all don't get anything else from my videos, let it be a testament over your life. Because if y'all have not noticed. Or maybe y'all haven't, because I do damn good editing. A lot of the times when I go out and I get ready to record, like literally today, I was in the house and it was dry outside. I'm looking outside. I've been kind of was outside in and out a little bit. But as soon as I, you know, put clothes on to, well, I ain't put no clothes on, I just put a sweater on. But as soon as I put it on to um, go outside and get ready to record, it started raining. And it was just like the universe is like, what you gonna do, hold up a fold up? You know what I'm saying? So I took my ass out here in the rain so that I can get content, have a video available. I'm walking, by the way, you see my backpack. This shit's real. Um, it ain't went a long walk, so I ain't gonna even, you know, cap like that. But yeah, so it just started raining. It's not cold, cold, but it's a little cold. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I've been through worse. You know, a little rain ain't gonna kill me. My hair got a little wet, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Definitely been through worse. But let my videos be a testament to you guys um, as to say, when you go to do things and and you get blockades, small blockades, you get, you know, small, you know, not small, large, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Something tries to stand against you, stand against what it is that you're doing. Don't let it stop you from doing what it is that you're doing. Don't let it stop you from reaching your goals. Don't let it stop you from, you know, being, you know, or trying to get or be who it is ultimately that you're destined to be. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I just, I just want y'all, I feel like the spirit was guiding me to give y'all that word, you know? So, don't be stopped. 
you know, don't let the pressures of the world stop you. It's gonna be okay, I promise. I love you. If nobody else told you today, happy holidays. And I'll see y'all on the next Vlogmas video. Thank you for watching. Peace.